We've all had one or two experiences in our lives where we're struck by what seems like an incredibly unlikely coincidence. And we wonder whether it means something more, whether it's evidence of hidden forces at work that have conspired to make this event happen. Maybe you find yourself thinking about an old friend from your childhood that you haven't heard from in many years. And at that very moment, you get a phone call or an email from them. Or you learn that a parent or relative has died, and you turn on the radio and their favorite song is playing. Or you read that someone won the lottery twice. There's a man in Florida who won $10 million in the state lotto in 2012 and won $3 million in 2013, using two different sets of numbers that he bought at the same 7-Eleven store. Now, you might be forgiven if you thought that this was evidence of divine intervention or go the other way and wonder whether the lotto was fixed in some way. Events like this pull us in two directions. On the one hand, we tend to think that these are extraordinarily unlikely events and conclude that they should be incredibly rare. And yet, events like these keep on happening. You can read about them every day. So they're not rare. They're actually very common. And this seems like a contradiction. How can unlikely events be simultaneously rare and common? This is our topic for this section. This is the question that we want to get a handle on. How should we interpret unlikely coincidences? Do they indicate the presence of forces that are working against random chance? Or are they really just a product of random chance? And if so, how do we reconcile that fact with how common these unlikely coincidences seem to be?